I'm not really a YouTuber and uh, I don't really know how to make long videos but I think it's very important now to show you my life and what is going on in my life because you have been asking so many questions about my business like damn I'm starting a new business I'm starting my first own business and I'm now in Turkey and I have so many things new in my life so I'm gonna share it with you maybe you'll just enjoy watching my videos while eating your dinner I don't know a small backstory first I'm Russian so I I don't have many opportunities to go to different countries because you know why <laughs> investing in something is better than just doing nothing with your money and starting a new business is like very cool so i decided to do it you know <laughs> and i decided to go to turkey where i'm actually right now it was not so expensive like it is expensive but it's not th that expensive like in europe for example the taxes are not so high and also i can stay here for some months which is impossible if you're Russian and you go, for example, to some European countries. Just, I'll show you everything and just count how many mistakes I have made. <laughs> Let's go. My friend and I decided to go to Starbucks. Actually, I want to buy a microphone. To, a like, microphone? Yeah, like a small microphone here. So nice. that I can uh, film something in public places. Like here. <laughs> <laughs> like, these are the pictures, but why some of them were like compressed? <laughs> I would choose this one. <laughs> I'm in Istanbul like for the last two weeks uh, and I do hear nothing <laughs> to be honest really nothing because I cannot find the proper place I am planning to open a bar uh, maybe a short bar because a lot of tourists come to Istanbul and here are loads of tourists and I haven't found a good short bar like in, for example, in the area where I live and this could be a great idea but I cannot find the place it's not so easy as I thought before because everything that I find on the special app it is written here it is taken like during a day and uh, I didn't expect this to be that uh, fast I scroll this app during the day and sometimes when I see something and I contact the person at the same moment as I see this um, message and he says sorry the place is taken and I'm like what <laughs> it cannot be so fast so I'm just scrolling this app again and again trying to find anything just like anything ah! after one week of helplessness crying and understanding nothing in a completely new language I have finally found something. It's already 11 p.m. I guess and I really want to go to sleep but uh, we decided to go to Izmir like in a few hours <laughs> only because um, it's the place, the town where we can sign the document. My mom and my brother are coming like in a, in a day so we should go tomorrow. We are buying now some tickets for our trip and wish me luck.
to take us from the airport but he said that we can come by ourselves so we're waiting for our train So we came to an abandoned station with no houses or people and there was literally no one. And even the man who invited us, he told us Yay. that we won't be able to find this place. Nice. Uh, I think we should go there or there, but they seem so lost in this world. We seem so lost in this world. I hope it's not the organ fabric. At last we came to his office and there was another challenge. We didn't know that he could not talk in English. Like oh, we were chatting in WhatsApp and it was fine. We were talking in English, but actually he couldn't say a word in English. We are done. Eight freaking hours. No, firstly, about four hours we were just. Uh, correcting the document, we were signing the document, we were checking all the details and then we decided to go to the restaurant just to make our friendship better, he you know? Invited us he invited that. us and uh, if you know it's better not to refuse Not to decline this offer Not to decline this offer The problem was that he doesn't know English and we don't know Turkish like, he knows a few words in English and we know a few words in Turkish. And our communication was only with Google Translator. But he still enjoyed it. He's a good man, he's very friendly. But my inner introvert is freaking out right now. I started What I didn't like was that this man, this businessman, thinks that women know nothing about business. Women. Women. What, what, what have I said? Woman. A woman. <laughs> She's too tired, guys. Women know nothing about business. And now we're here at the airport and we are waiting for the um, plane, which is late for one hour. I'm getting ready 
to go to the airport because my mother and my brother are coming to Istanbul. I haven't seen my family for the whole year, I guess, like for the last 10 months. And I'm really happy they come to Istanbul. And my father has sometimes projects in different countries. So now he's in another town, in another city in uh, Turkey. So we're going to meet in Istanbul uh, and then go to my father to meet him and we will like be the whole family together. Yeah. <laughs> it won't last long. We're meeting like for for five or seven days and it's not that much. But it's still something and I'm really happy to see my family at last because if you don't know I study in Germany and so my family is from Russia so we don't meet that often. This is, by the way, my daily sun cream because my skin is so pale and I'm really afraid to go outside without um, without sun protection. My hair is still wet, but still. Well, look. Uh, my bag. And let's go. Yay! Mm -hmm. so That's <laughs> place of cut mama. <laughs> Mama's in the gang. Yay! I live meet with my mom and my brother and we're at the station to go to Ankara. It's the city where my dad works. <laughs> Good morning, Professor Xavier. <laughs> We were trying to catch a taxi for too long because our hotel was 40 minutes drive from the railway station. But I wasn't searching because I had a more important thing to do, to film videos. We found a taxi! It's like 40 minutes drive from here <laughs> and there is no bus and no ta taxi so we're going just like this um, along the road. H how long should we go there? About four hours. I, I don't think we will go there for four hours. But, uh, no taxi available. No taxi available. No, we're just gonna walk until we see a taxi. Genius. <laughs> My dad was at work, so we decided to go to the city center uh, to the mausoleum where actually the most popular Turkish ruler, uh, Mustafa Kemal the Turk, uh, was uh, buried. There are so many uh, people. All over the kids were found out in the 
Chilling. We have a problem. I have a problem. Um, I have remembered the song, but I don't know the lyrics. And I don't remember. <laughs> uh, I don't know the, the lyrics, and I don't remember the rhythm. But you know, I still remember it in my head, and I have to like hear it because to listen to it because. It's important. Uh, I will I will sing this song for you, but maybe you will understand it. I, I don't know. I'm really sorry if my song could destroy your faith in humanity. Don't, don't listen. I think it's like this. <laughs> she keeps me like I'm a prisoner. No. She just... doesn't give me my passport. No, just just give us the taxi. Schneller, schneller. How was your day? <laughs> I found a home for my brother. He will fit properly like that. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, good. Like, stand here. Please, stand here. Uh, can, can you see it? A little bit more. Yeah, perfect. Our next stop was a prison museum. And I have no idea why, but it was called Hilton. Hilton. <laughs> On the road back to Istanbul, we were thinking about the future bar and a cool idea was to create it as a lab and maybe combine it with Breaking Bad or Rick and Morty themes. place looks awful <laughs> it looks so bad because look at this color whoever would like to sit in a cafe with this color it's so awful i don't know what should i do like this is the place where uh, the staff works for example here is the place for the bartender like the cocktails should be done here and it's so bad. They just left cigarettes, fucking cups here with, with mold. Oh, it looks disgusting. But actually, the place itself it's not so bad because just look. Like, here's the entrance, and here is our place. I know it's not so wide, but. It's not that bad. Like for a short bar, it could be very good. Uh. Cool. Our next stop was to measure all the walls and start searching for the for the furniture. More comfortable than a bottle. <laughs> money, money, money. It must be funny when the rich man's world. 
Uh, the coolest elevator I've ever seen. Look. <laughs> Zero. Yeah. It just goes. We went so many times to government agencies to obtain permits for the bar, like to get the alcohol allowance, some permits for the gas, for um, electricity and so on. We didn't get the alcohol allowance. Send help. It's been five days uh, and we have a problem. We already have a company, we already have uh, the proper name for the company, but the problem is that we cannot sell the alcohol and the bar cannot exist without this license. So the problem is that there is a mosque rather close to, to our place and it should be more than 100 meters so we can sell alcohol. So <clears throat> there are a lot of bars here like uh, our neighbors are also uh, selling alcohol but maybe they got the license uh, some years early before us uh, because in 2013, I guess, it was um, the rules were not so strict and you could get this license, but now, but now it's a problem. We should have known this. We should have uh, checked this before. It is how it is, and I guess we should change the name of the company and we should change the whole concept okay <laughs> after a few days i started to feel worse She refused to watch Guardians of the Galaxy 3 with me. Oh, it was. Because I want to watch it in the movie, in the cinema. <laughs> On the way home, I felt even worse, and I didn't know why, but I was wet as hell. On the next day, I started to feel worse, much more worse, and I had high temperature for the next few days, and it was a huge problem to lower this temperature. This is the fourth day with high temperature. I have 38, I think, or even more, like 38 and 2, something like that. Uh, I won't show you my hair because they look messier than the mess. <laughs> Pretty disgusting. And I like the view. The sun is shining. Yoohoo! It's already a few things. In a few days, I was able to get up and I went to the hospital to get some tests done. Dots, this one is a problem. I think so. I got a max here. Yeah. It's a maxi air. I hope we get a <laughs> how it's called in English? Dinosaur. <laughs> I want a dinosaur, no matter what you want. Uh, I, how it's called in English? I want a dinosaur. A dinosaur! 
the toy is the main thing in the egg and the chocolates are just no no chocolate is very important but the most important is the white part no no offense like it's not a joke but i also always like Why chocolate more? You're not supposed to say so, I believe. Why? Like, it's only about chocolate. Nothing. I promise. I swear. Mm -hmm. Should I do like Ninjago? <laughs> <laughs> she broke it. You guys, so you know it, she broke it. It's not like Yay! in Ninjago. Yay! You can take the the one with no yay <laughs> with no <laughs> yay. It's a dinosaur. Fuck! It's an orangutan, I believe. Mm. Collect the parts. We can't. Oh wait. Two hours later. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> One <laughs> thousand years later. You think you are smart, but I am who is making something, who is doing something, you know? I'm feeling much better right now. And I have more energy to work and to do this uh, business stuff. I still have some problems with the place because I have rented uh, because I have rented this place uh, for the next six months. So I have already paid for it and I just have to do something with this place. And I didn't get this uh, alcohol allowance, so I cannot make a bar out of it. <sighs> so I had some time to think about it and to imagine what can we create out of this place because it's it's rather small and it has it almost has no windows i know it sounds very very bad but still i think we can create something out of it just i want now i just really want to make something to show myself that it is possible and i have an idea what about making an asian restaurant out of it i'm not talking about the a sushi bar or just a huge uh, Asian restaurant. No, no, no. I'm just talking about the uh, small, tiny, um, very cute restaurant, maybe with ramen, because have you ever tried ramen? It's tasty. I haven't uh, seen the place with ramen in Istanbul, especially in my area. So maybe this could, this could be possible. We can just try. Why not? <laughs> and now we have so much work to do. Like, we have to find the stuff, find the cooks. Um, I need to create the menu. Uh, also the design of the menu, the design of the place. Uh, and I have to order the furniture and to order the plates, the dishes and everything what we need. Uh, and and we have to find the, the workers we, uh, that would work in the place. And you know what? I still don't know the name of this future restaurant. <laughs> Just give me some time. We went to the cinema, watched the Guardians of the Galaxy. Quite newer than might be. But it was Guardians of the Family. Looking for you. Oh, we're not. No, we don't. We don't have Guardians of the Galaxy. It's a setup. Shit. Shit. We're going to Rome. Oh, Hootie, F eats a burger without the top bun. Yeah, I 
I have actually uh, decided to do some English practices because I don't uh, feel very fluent uh, while talking in English. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> um, extension? Extension? What is it? That's good. Yeah, extension means to, to give extra time. I don't do it, but now, when I was living at home, we would try and recycle uh, yeah, plastics and paper. There was a new problem. I had no name and no logo. I still don't have uh, the logo, um, but I have some ideas what to do. Like, uh, you know, the name of the place would be uh, Kokoro. In Japanese, it is hard, and I think it's very easy to learn. Like, Kokoro. I don't know, I just like it. And the way it is written in Japanese, it's rather pretty I guess and uh, I think with this like symbol with this word uh, we can do a, a logo who knows I'll try to <sighs> I'm in the cafe now and I think it's ready. I'm not sure, but I kind of like it. Okay, I'm very happy. I like it. I like it a lot. Yesterday at night, I understood that I don't like my logo. <laughs> and I don't have time to find a person uh, who will do a logo for me because the man who makes the website uh, he asked me to give him the logo and I still don't have it! Yay! I decided to improvise a bit and uh, now I have a new variation like this is the old one and this is <laughs> this is the new one I think it's minimalistic, stylish and when you see it you just think about some Japanese or Asian culture Great! <laughs> So this is like the sign of Kokoro, it's hard or it's soul in uh, Japanese. This is the transcription and uh, this uh, circle, red circle, symbolizes also Japan. And this, I, I don't know what these things are. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Part 2 is coming soon.